My name is Balindi Leganjomo. I am a South African actor, theatre maker and scholar. What convergence has come to mean to me is perhaps less the idea of coming together and more the realisation that we were never separate to begin with. So many of the ideas that are shared and spread around the topic of convergence speak to African ideas generated by African minds, African solutions to African problems that transcend our borders, they transcend our languages, they transcend our cultures. It's said that if you want to go far, go together, and I'm excited to see how far we can get when we converge. My name is Seth Kusmet, a documentary photographer from Morocco. What convergence means to me, it's kind of a movement, a common vision for an entire nation that will help us grow and build a better future for us, for our country, for our continent, but also for the world. Hi there, uh, this is Afala Bijo, a filmmaker here in Nigeria. And convergence means um, coming together and not just coming together, growing together. Because there's no point of coming together without growing. And I believe we as Africans, we need to come together and grow together. Growing in the right places, like in the economic sector, financially, structurally, and so many other things. Most importantly, setting the right policies and the right effective policies for growth in Africa. My name is Priska Ojwang and I'm a multimedia artist from Nairobi, Kenya. I use music, storytelling and visuals to express my ideas. This project has been a hint of what convergence is, with Balindile from South Africa, Israel from Nigeria, Seif from Morocco and myself from Nairobi. I've come to realize that when we bring in our ideas and our experiences together, we come out with a richer, deeper experience and expression. Europe, Europe, We overdress, we my events. We care too much about how we look to you. We get it wrong. We, get it wrong. we ought to look like we don't give a We show a ridiculous groom bearing elaborate gifts. We are too formally grateful. We cringe in silent shame. We cringe in silent shame for you. For us without sharing. Serve yourselves first. Insult us without knowing. Kutiwa itemba albulali. Kutiwa uhamba ugbona. Kuti windu gwentle ka uwezizweni. Salsusa uhambo lute, uhambo nga pelio, uhambo nga nginamba nge nginamba, salsuse sadiola emali, sehamba nge nyawo, sehamba stratula, sehamba slutula, sehamba sekutato lengu ujeni. Pata, pata, pata. Sae safiga emali, sae safiga epamako, sangena endizeni, sandi zangempela, sangena espaga pageni, sae safiga emanu. Pata, pata, pata. Sangena escape ni sahamba ngulwandle sae safiga ezwe nilisha espain. Pata, 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 pata. Salsusa futi uhambo nga pelio sahamba ngeskepe seka ulwandle sae safiga e france ezwe nilisha. Silo kushambile sahambo uhambo nga pelio sahambo uhambo ulnez nginamba ngez nginamba. Don't tell about Johnny, my brothers, don't tell about Johnny, my 
sisters Running away from misery Running away from misery Running away from misery And you can't find yourself in a double misery You don't decide to leave your misery behind From the bad situation in your country You decide to leave misery behind From the bad situation in your country Now you jump into the boat Now you jump into the boat To cross the ocean With all your family Looking, looking for better situation across the ocean, but you never arrive. Don't take the boat, Jenny, my brothers. Don't take the boat, Jenny, my sisters. Don't take the boat, Jenny, my brothers. Don't take the boat, Jenny, my sisters. Splice a history, price a country, dice a people, slice a heart, entice what's been erased back into story. Listen, my father speaks Urdu, 
language of dancing peacocks, rose water fountains, even its curses are beautiful. He speaks Hindi, suave and melodic, earthy Punjabi, salty rich as sag paneer, coastal Swahili laced with Arabic. He speaks Gujarati, solid ancestral pride. Five languages, five different worlds, yet English shrinks him down before white men. In a country, there are two things that you must protect. That you must have peace, stability, and justice. And you can't have one without the other. You cannot have justice where there is no peace. Pardon me, pardon me, I'm speaking too fast. Feeling parity, parity, I just want to chat. There's a part of me, part of me that may not faire la paix sur nous. Nous pourrons également utiliser ces immenses potentialités pour développer l'Afrique parce que notre sol, notre sous-sol sont riches. Nous avons suffisamment de bras et nous avons un marché immense, très vaste, du nord au sud, de l'est à l'ouest. Nous avons suffisamment de capacités intellectuelles pour créer ou tout au moins prendre la technologie et la science partout où nous pourrons les retrouver. Monsieur le Président, faisons en sorte que nous mettions au point ce fonds uni d'Addis Abeba contre la dette. Faisons en sorte que ce soit à partir d'Addis Abeba que nous décidions de limiter la course aux armements entre pays faibles et pauvres. Les gourdins et les coutelas que nous achetons sont inutiles. Faisons en sorte également que le marché africain soit le marché des Africains. Produire en Afrique, transformer en Afrique et consommer en Afrique. Produisons ce dont nous avons besoin et consommons ce que nous nous produisons au lieu d'importer. Il n'y a pas un seul fil qui vienne de l'Europe. Je ne fais pas un défilé de mode, mais je voudrais simplement dire, mais je voudrais simplement dire que nous devons accepter de vivre africain. C'est la seule façon de vivre libre et de vivre digne. Je vous remercie, Monsieur le Président. La partie ou la mort nous vaincront. Que nous devons donner à chaque femme un emploi. Nous devons donner à chaque femme le moyen de gagner honnêtement et dignement sa vie. If we are considering a union as a panacea, as a magic wand which removes all our economic problems, clearly we will be disappointed. When we in Ethiopia support this union, we support it not because we believe this will be a magic wand, but because we believe a bigger economic space is in the interest of all of us. Every African knows how it feels, every Ethiopian knows how it feels to be alone. We were alone on the table of the Europeans during the League of Nations. And we know what happened to us then. Now we are not alone. We have 53 African countries.
in this room for one hour. Let's be easy in our skins. Observe ourselves with gentle curiosity. Prefer and accept selected morsels of our lives. Let's regard each other with eyes that smile, with faces that engage, savor without urgency the strangeness of being human. I make mountains out of molehills. And it can be quite the scene Think about how far I've come And my life looking greater than it's ever been If I could eat my pie in the sky It would be just my thing Sipping on my champagne And my life looking greater than it's ever been My life looking greater than it's ever been your wings in the sun you must be african son how did you rise so fast i agree with the african union because i assume it will be an instrument of fundamental transformation of our economy from that of rent collection to that of value creation and therefore i accept this union as an organizing principle rather than as a reflection of